all right guys i'm back again uh this time with a cold start on the new powermate wx series of generator uh, this generator was sent to me for review from Primac america all right guys so now i have it out of the garage i'm gonna do a true cold start on it that means bringing it out from exactly how i would have it stored uh, for emergency purposes so i just Put a little bit of gas in here so you see the fuel gauge is still not moved really uh, the fuel is off carburetor is dry from the last time i ran it around four days ago so we're going to turn the fuel on fuel peacock carburetor's already in the uh, choke position it's over to the left gonna let that sit for a few seconds just to fill up the uh, bowl give it a few dry pools and then we'll see how many pools it takes to give it a uh, few, uh, a real cold start. A lot of times people will uh, already have fuel in their carburetor. That's not how I store mine. I store gas tank empty, carburetor empty, unit is ice cold. I'll prove that by grabbing the exhaust. The exhaust is ice cold, as you see. Spark arrestor and everything. And uh, we'll give you a shot of the multimeter on this thing. Uh, it's pretty cool. I'll have a full review on this guy in about a week. I've been testing it for about a week. But I'll give it a week more. Put some more hours on it. Right now it has about eight before I give my uh, final review. So we'll go ahead, turn the switch on, put the handles down. This so it makes it a little bit easier to pull the string. And we'll give it about three dry pulls. Just lubricate the cylinder. I always do this with every generator I have. Tilt it a little bit. Since there's very little gas in here, just to get that carburetor nice and full. Then we'll see how many pools it takes to start. Well, it almost started. There we go. Two pools. All right guys, so it's fully warmed up. I thought I'd bring out a big load for it. Uh, this is a 12,000 BTU uh, Frigidaire air conditioner that I sometimes use in the summer. All right, the pressure just kicked on. Let's take a look at what the uh, generator's putting out as far as power. Been running three minutes, 118 volts, and 60 or 61 hertz. All right, so about 40 feet, um, we're producing 71 decibels. So fairly quiet. Um, you can tell it's quiet it's just because it's uh, surrounded by walls that it's loud up close to it, but. As far as you running this in a residential neighborhood, people aren't really going to be able to hear this. So, works out pretty good. Alright guys, check back with the review. About a week. See you guys later.